Hello guys, welcome to EasyTV Presents Tech View, another episode. In this episode, I will show you actually how you can download uh, BMR BSPR ESXi. Um, so you need to know actually from where you can download and, and also how you're going to download. So whoever is downloading after 2024, like after 2024, uh, July, you have to put a different uh, website or different portal. The reason is previous, in my previous video, uh, I shows actually how you can download BMR, VSPR, ESXi from BMR portal. But um, BMR sold to Broadcom, that's why the BMR, uh, the download portal on the BMR side is not working anymore. So you have to go to broadcom.com. Broadcom so, which is called like as uh, https colon slash slash support dot broadcom dot com. And obviously, um, you have to have your account there. And you can have your own personal account. And also, you can have, if you work for a company, you will have a account through your company, like you, through your company email address. So I'm going to show you step by step. Let's get started. Uh, so I already, uh, so just open your browser from your computer and just type HTTPS. If you, if you double click on here, you can see HTTPS colon slash slash support dot broadcom dot com. That's it. And then click login. All right. So you're gonna get the login screen and and you can put your username and password. But if you don't have it, then you can just register. In the previous screen you saw, like there was two buttons. One is register, one is login. I click on login because I have already account. But if you don't have account, just click register, then register it. And then after that, you will be able to log in. So now I'm going to log in in my account. And um, I'm, I'm, I'm going to log in. So I'm going to actually, uh, pause the video and I after I, I'm successfully logged in, then I'll back here again. All right, I'm logging successfully. Uh, if you if you look at here, I'm the if is showing my name, so I I logged in here, right? So after you successfully log in, where do you need to go to download your optimal goal is to download the BMR BSPR ESXi software, right? ESXi ISO file. So all the way left side, you're gonna see there is a two options. So one is software and hardware. Click on the software and then go to the BMR Cloud Foundation. And you can see here the plus sign, click here. And then you're gonna see my downloads. Click my downloads. And then, and then it will give you on the left side and right side, there is a lot of tools. All these are BMR uh, tools. It, it, it's a different different types of tools like NSX is for uh, network virtualization. Uh, they have a cloud um, director. They have a cloud director API launcher, you know, BMR area. There's a lot of different different types of uh, BMR tools and software. So, but you have to find out your. Um, uh, we are looking for BMR BSPR ESXi, but BMR BSPR ESXi is not showing here. So. You see here, there's a two page, one and two. Right now we are in one. So click on number two page. And then from the right side, you see B, uh, BMR VSphere, BMR VSphere Plus. So you don't need to go to Plus, just click on simple BMR VSphere. And then, all right. And then from here, there's also BMR BSPR has different different types like BSPR Dexter, BSPR Standard, Platinum, Essential. All these are licensed. So most of the company, they use Enterprise Plus. And you, your target will be download Enterprise Plus. It's the highest level. So BMR BSPR Enterprise Plus. All these are licensed, actually the license name, Essential plus license or essentials license or platinum license or standard license, right? That depends on the license name, the price will be different. But most of the company, uh, they use enterprise plus because enterprise plus has all kind of features. So go to go for the enterprise plus. If you, if you like uh, select this one, you're gonna see here, there's a arrow sign, click here. 
and then it will show you which version you want to download. It depends on you. So I'm just going to show you on 6.7. Click 6.7. So you can go for seven or you can go for eight, it's up to you. And then if you click here, it's not gonna show you anything. You can maybe go back to seven or eight if you want. And in here, you can see BMR, VSPR, Hypervisor, ESXi, right? BMR, um, our target is to download this one, right? So if, uh, and here you're gonna see the view group, click on view group, and then it will take you to the another page where you will be able to change because BMR 6.7 has a different, different types of version. 6.7.0, 6.7.0, update one, update two, update three, update three B. This is the last one. So it depends on you which one you want to download. So my target now is to download this one. 6.7, uh, update one. So I'm going to click this one. All right, now it's showing primary download. This is the version of BMR BSPR. But, but right now, what I'll do, this is the this is BMR BSPR uh, from the BMR side, right? But again, enterprise-wise, whenever you wanna work for enterprise server, based on your server manufacturer, like if you are going to install your ESXi on a Cisco, in that case, you should have, you should download <clears throat> Cisco customized ESXi. If you work with Dell server, if you want to install ESXi on a Dell server, then you should go for Dell customized ESXi, ISO file. And if you work in the HP server, and if you want to install ESXi on HP physical server, in that case, you should download HP customized ESXi. So, and also if you use any other third party Lenovo or any other, so all, whatever you can, whatever the server is, you should go for customize. So you, if you can look at here on the top menu, um, it says custom ISO, right? Click here. And now, it's gonna show you actually all the custom CCHP, Dell, Cisco, uh, all those uh, like vendor server, right? So my target is to Dell customize ESXi, right? What, where I gonna click, I will click here. So if I expand it like this, it give me two software, like two, one is zip file and one is ISO file, but my target is to ISO. My target is to ISO. So you just need to look for which one is for ISO. That one, download that one. So I know this is this is what I'm looking for. I can I can simply download from here, right? So when I'm going to download here, it's not giving me options to download. Why? Because here's the agreement. You have to check mark on it. Now you'll be able to download. If you click here, it's gonna start download. So I already downloaded. I can show you here. I already downloaded. You see here, I, I have already downloaded here. The same one the same one I have already downloaded. So this is the process. This is the process, this is the way you can download. So that's all. And then you can transfer the file, whatever the place you want. You can just move the file, maybe on your jump machine, maybe any other machine, whatever the machine you want to use it. So you can just move that software or maybe you can keep it on your uh, laptop also. It's up to you that's all thank you thanks for watching and um if you are new in my channel please subscribe my channel and um also if you think this video is helpful uh you can give a big thumbs up and also don't forget to make some comments and because your comments makes me um encourage me a lot to make more videos for you guys and thank you again thanks for watching bye